what, what was the relationship like between yourself and, and Jose Mourinho during your time at Chelsea? I would say distant. Mm. Um, I'm, not, I'm not really somebody who speaks a lot with coaches. I think uh, if a coach wants to speak with you, then you just do it. He's, he's the boss. Uh, you can be good with each other, but still there's a distance between a coach and a player. I only spoke with him twice. That's when I wanted to leave to, to Dortmund in the beginning of the summer. Goetze left for Munich, so I thought there's a perfect uh, role for me. There's nobody there. Yeah, I had to stay. I will get my chances. And then the second meeting was just uh, before New Year, where everybody gets like sort of evaluation, how things go and how you're feeling. And then I just said, like, for me, it's better to go. I want to I wanna play football. Your manager being so distant, and not having those conversations to suppose help you in your development. Was that tough at that age? To be fair, it wasn't really tough. Uh, I just did what I needed to do, uh, but I was doing my job well. I was training hard. I, I, I felt for me at the time was better to go permanently and have a different situation then going on loan, come back again and have the, facing the same problem. Was you asked to play maybe a certain way that didn't suit you? Do you feel that that maybe was a reason why it didn't quite work well, out? I don't know. Um, a lot of people saw me as a winger. I never felt myself as a winger. I can dribble when I need to, but that's not my game. I have a passing game. I'm very different. But I always said in my beginning career, I'm always going to end up centrally. And 